when you start to talk about death and dying in meaningful ways, you what you are really doing is giving yourself a chance to learn more about who you are. And not just yourself, but your loved ones and the people that are close to you. Hello, my name is John Ashworth. I'm relatively new here to Fraser Consultants, but I am the man in front of the camera delivering these important messages to you, our, our valued customers. And, and so we thought it would be a great idea for us to just give you a little bit sense of who I am, where I came from, and what I've been doing, and how I landed here at Fraser Consultants. The most interesting thing that's happened in just a couple of weeks of being a part of this organization is that I have a whole new understanding of what it means to be open to and talking about death and dying and funeral arrangements. Prior to coming here, I was just like everybody else. Talking about death, talking about funerals feels negative. It feels like it might be a little bit of bad luck. It feels taboo. Just the other night, I had a really, really meaningful conversation with my in-laws about their whole pre-planning process as part of their what they plan to do when they die for their funerals. And it was a very unique opportunity for me to connect with them in a very deep and meaningful way, in a new way. I'll always cherish that conversation that I had with them. As I have landed here at Fraser Consultants, I realized that this is really an important part of the mission of us helping you as the funeral homeowner help your client families and potential customers understand that this is an important part of the process and really bringing them in and sitting them down and talking with them about what kind of an experience they're looking for so that you can create that for them. You know, about 10 years ago, my sister Wendy, younger sister Wendy died, and I always felt like her whole process of how she died in the hospital and then went on to be cremated and then the memorial service, which didn't happen until at least a month later, I always felt like that experience could have been a lot more organized and meaningful and powerful for me. And that would have really helped me heal in the short run. And now that I've come to work here at Fraser Consultants, I really have begun to gain a better understanding of why I felt that way, of why that is so important. Prior to coming to Fraser Consultants, I was a clinical exercise physiologist. I worked for somebody by the name of Dr. Dean Ornish back in California. And he was a revolutionary doctor who understood that there was this deep connection between love and survival. That building meaningful connections with participants in his heart disease reversal program and then in his prostate cancer research program, he could really help them heal. And that was one of the best experiences I had professionally. It changed my life. It changed who I was forever. And as I've landed here at Fraser Consultants, I feel like I have the same kind of opportunity because as I come into work here every day and I interact with the staff and Matt, the owner, I really have begun quickly to understand how important the work that we do is for you. So I look forward to coming to you regularly with videos just like this one with resources, tools, tips, strategies, insights to help you run your funeral business more effectively, more efficiently, and more profitably because you as a funeral homeowner have a very, very unique opportunity. You have an opportunity that most other business owners don't have. You have the opportunity to have personal influence, not just over the client families that you're working with, but the local communities that you serve. And I look forward to being a part of that. Thanks for watching this video. For more information, you can go to fraserconsultants.com.